Human teeth may be able to grow a third time with this drug. It's amazing. The life cycle of human teeth goes through distinctive developmental stages, starting from milk teeth to permanent teeth. In childhood, children have milk teeth, the first set of teeth that everyone develops. Typically, milk teeth begin to emerge when a child is about six months old and continue to fully develop around the age of two to three years. From about six to 12 years old, Milk teeth are gradually replaced by permanent teeth. This process is known as tooth replacement. Milk teeth begin to loosen and fall out to make way for the permanent teeth growing underneath. By adulthood, a normal person will have a total of 32 permanent teeth, including wisdom teeth that develop later, usually in the age range of 17 to 25. However, permanent teeth do not always last forever. Teeth can be lost due to various reasons such as tooth decay, gum disease, trauma, accidents, or age. When teeth are lost, many people rely on replacement methods like dentures or dental implants. Nevertheless, a recent discovery in the medical field could change our understanding of the life cycle of teeth. Japanese researchers have discovered the possibility that humans could develop a third set of teeth. Thanks to stimulating the USA G1 gene, conditions can be created for tooth buds, previously thought to exist only in the embryonic stage, to develop into new teeth. This opens up the possibility of tooth restoration for people who lose teeth for various reasons, a significant advancement in the field of dentistry and regenerative medicine. In a groundbreaking advancement in modern medicine, a team of Japanese researchers has opened up the possibility that humans could grow a third set of teeth. Based on a 2021 study, this work not only sheds light on the ability to regenerate teeth in animals but also aims at clinical trials on humans starting from 2024. Katsu Takahashi, the lead researcher and head of the dentistry and oral surgery department at the Medical Research Institute Katano Hospital in Osaka, has spent many years studying the potential for new tooth growth. He and his team focused on the USA G1 gene, a crucial factor in tooth development. They developed a drug that inhibits the protein synthesized by this gene, enabling mice to grow new teeth. A significant aspect of this research is the discovery that humans already have the buds of a third set of teeth within our mouths. Takahashi and his team believe that by activating these tooth buds through gene intervention, they can promote the growth of new teeth in humans. This research not only opens up hope for people suffering from anodonta, a genetic condition that prevents a full set of teeth from growing, but also marks a significant turning point in the field of dentistry. The growth of new teeth, once only a dream for dental professionals, may soon become a reality. Takahashi, who once stated that he had dreamed of this since his postgraduate days, hopes that in the not too distant future, tooth growth stimulation medication will become a third option alongside dentures and implants. If everything goes smoothly in the upcoming clinical trials, the world may witness a major leap in tooth regeneration by 2030. As we anticipate the commencement of clinical trials in 2024, the future of dentistry looks promising. The success of these trials could lead to widespread availability of this groundbreaking treatment by 2030, marking a new era in regenerative dental medicine. The vision of Dr. Takahashi, once a distant dream, is now closer to reality, potentially offering people the chance to regain their natural teeth, enhancing not just dental health but also the quality of life. This exciting development underscores the relentless pursuit of medical science in improving human health and well-being. Promising a future where regenerative treatments could become a norm, profoundly impacting our approach to healthcare and life itself.